It's no secret that the Android platform is a little more chill than Apple in terms of content. As we talked about a couple weeks ago, only on the Android market could an app like Boyfriend Maker exist. You know, the twisted virtual boyfriend for ages 4 and up. But we finally discovered an app that may be too tasteless even for Android. A series of apps from creator Kimberly Dice ask, have you ever imagined yourself as a person of another nationality? Well, now that you bring it up, no. But you can anyway now thanks to the Make Me Russian, Irish, Indian, and Asian apps in the Google Play Store. These are apps where you upload or take a picture of yourself, and it basically slaps a bunch of lame stereotypes onto your image according to a particular designation. Irish, for example. Ever really wanted to be Irish? Not really, maybe on St. Paddy's Day? Well, according to the Make Me Irish app, all it takes is a red beard, some freckles, a messed up face, and a black eye. Get it? There are a couple of other options, each of which will offend the hell out of a lot of people. As context, the studio is also responsible for a number of cheap, dirty apps that can make you fat, bald, old, or whatever else you never wanted to be, like a guy with a Fu Manchu. Now, as silly as these apps are, they've gotten 50 to 100,000 downloads each, according to the site App Annie. And as you can imagine, many are not too thrilled. There's a campaign to remove the apps circulating on change.org. The petition is asking Google Play to remove the Make Me Asian and Make Me Indian apps from the store, saying that they perpetuate false stereotypes and cause harm to the communities in question. So far, it's received close to 2,000 signatures. So, Android users, what, if anything, do you see as crossing a line of taste in an app? Let us know in the comments. As for our t-shirt winner, yesterday we asked what you thought about BitTorrent. Are they sincere about their non-piracy campaign? Today's winner is TJP82492. They said, it's like any tool. If you use it for good purposes, then it's a good tool. If you use it for the wrong purposes, then it is your fault, not the fault of the creator. And also, congratulations to our second t-shirt winner for spotting the Easter egg in our episode. Our green screen was showing for a few seconds. So embarrassing. The first to notice and comment was DrawD8999. 144, 150, I see green screen, not the TFN logo. So that concludes our holiday t-shirt giveaway. Thank you to everyone who entered and congrats to all our winners. If you send us a photo of yourself wearing your shirt, we'll put it in an episode. Happy holidays, this is Annie for TFN.